NL East rivals square off on Father's Day in Atlanta as the Braves play host to the Mets. It's a good pitching matchup in this one as Julio Tehran squares off against Matt Harvey. And Tehran gets some help on defense in the second as he faces Michael Kadire. Bloop towards center field. That might fall. Mabin racing in. Lays out. He caught it. Cameron Mabin like Superman diving straight toward the infield after running at top speed picked it inches off the grass. This one's hit down the left field line. Perez long run foul. Brown, did he make the catch? Wow. He did make the catch and then slammed into the wall. Kadair couldn't stop his swing. He wanted an appeal. Instead, he's rung up. As this ball's grounded to short, six to four, two, three, a double play. And he just struck out Lagares to end the Mets sixth inning. Julio's looking sharp. He won the battle with a fastball. Kelly Johnson didn't get it and is struck out. And Uribe is down on strikes. Pedro Siriaco has been announced as the Braves pinch hitter, ending the night for Julio Tehran, who went seven innings of one hit ball tonight. Now, one thing you have to keep in mind with LeVarne Way. He does not run well as a big man out at second base. Broken bat into center field, a base hit. Here comes Lamar Way. Lagaris loads up. His throw is terrible. It's 1 0 Atlanta. One to nothing Braves in the top of the ninth on Father's Day. Terry Collins, hopeful of playing more baseball, has Bobby Parnell warming up in the bullpen. 1 0 pitch. Broken bat ground ball to third. A rebate feeds Peterson on the first double play. And the Braves have swept the New York Mets right out of town. 1 0 Atlanta is your final in the series finale. Jim Johnson gets the save in place of Jason Grilly, who was unavailable on Sunday. Teron improves his record to 5 and 3 with his seven innings of one hit ball. The Mets have now lost five in a row, but they do get some good news on Sunday. X-rays on the hyperextended elbow of catcher Travis Darno come back negative.